Hey guys, welcome back to another video. As you saw, I gave you a little preview at the start of the video at what those cars look like. And this is, it's just mind-blowing to me because this is a very important day in NASCAR history. I mean, for decades, we've had cars that really don't, for the most part, look like their NASCAR stock counterparts. Um, I'll grab a Ford Mustang diecast here, for example. Um, I'll pick Brad Keselowski's, um, Lance truck parts car, but, you see, this doesn't look like a real Mustang. It's, for the most part, just one of these Ford Fusions, the Mustang plastered on the front of it. You know, I know I said in my other video that I thought the Gen 6 Mustang looks really good, but as the car in the leaked next-gen car picture... That Mustang does not look anything like the Mustang that was revealed today. And I want to say, I don't think the one that was actually revealed is ugly. And I kind of, I had an idea in my head that the one in the, um, in the, um, video I made might have been kind of photoshopped maybe by the person who took the photo. I don't know. The Mustang does not look anything like it did today, and I think the Mustang is the best looking out of all three of the manufacturer's cars. Now, I'm going to, once again, do thumb face cam because I want to kind of talk about each car. So, starting with the Ford Mustang, I really like it. This car is sexy, um, man, oh my gosh, I can't wait to see these cars on track, it, I am just, this car is beautiful, I like it a lot, now, um, I'll go, I'll go to the next image here, you guys will only probably see one image, I might, I, I'll switch the images up, I'll try, I'll try for you guys, the front of the car, it still looks kind of low to the ground. It still kind of looks like, you know, I said in that one video, it looked kind of ugly. But looking, getting to see it from other angles, I do really like it now. Now the back of the car, it's kind of all over the place. Um, but you know, I'll roll with it. It's not that big of a deal. I mean, yeah, that's really it. I mean, the back of the car, that's really just what you look at the most. Um, you know, I think the Ford Mustang is definitely a good place to start. And I think, you know, that, um, you know, this car, it'll look good on track. And I hopefully with all the paint schemes and stuff, it'll look, you know, almost as good as the current one. Okay, up to the Chevy one. Okay. Okay. I really like this. It looks almost the same as the one from, since like, 2018, kind of. Oh, and one thing I will say, one thing I do hate about these cars is they got, um, the, um, little vents on the hood. And I'm sorry if my head keeps going out of frame like this. That's because I'm in a different studio and I can't really help that. I'm sitting in a broken chair right now. Probably not the best idea, but we're doing it anyways. Um, I'll change these pictures up for you guys like I did the Ford. Um, we're going to the next picture. The front of the Chevy. It looks good, actually. My messy hair is always messy. That's why I always wear a hat. Um, the front of... Oh, and if you hear a cat meowing, I'm sorry. I have cats. I can't really do anything about that, unfortunately. Back of the Camaro, like I said, it's really weirdly shaped. Um, same thing like with the Mustang, but I'll roll with it. There's really nothing they can do about it. It fits the chassis, you know. Um, the back of the Camaro, um, from a head-on view, looks really nice. Car looks really sleek. Um, I'm digging it. I'm digging it. I'm digging it. On to the Toyota Camry. Okay. I really like it. I really do. 
I don't like the roof that the roof is lower than the current one because that just makes it look like a fat late model. To be honest, this car just looks like a fat late model. To be honest, it looks like they just took the front panel from a current Cup Series Toyota Camry and slapped it right on here. I'm not sure how I feel about that. It will grow on me, maybe. Um, the front of it, from the front on view, that looks okay. Kind of just looks like a current one. Um, I'll have all these pictures in the video so you can see what I'm talking about. Um, the side view of the camera, I actually think they did the back of this ca the camera really well. Like, it's not weirdly shaped at all like the other ones, and I think it looks really good. Yeah, and especially from, like, the head-on view of the back, it looks nice. It looks nice. It looks awesome. I am just ooh, wiping the sweat off my head, you know? Man, man, man. I love these cars. Maybe in the coming years we'll see Dodge, Honda, Hyundai. Which is not the same thing as Honda. Um, but, yeah. Um, wow. That's really all I'm gonna say for this video, guys. I'll put that preview that I had at the start of the video at the end of the video, too. But, with that, thank you guys for watching. Make sure you comment, like, and subscribe. And I'll see you guys next time. Goodbye.